bars in a ring. Man, I go hard like Stan Tan. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry, because I, I know my team here, and I've, I've seen my team, and I know I where. I know more about Chelsea than you. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Right, yeah. so let's talk about the Chelsea game today. Oh. Ruben Loftus Cheek scored the winner. <laughs> who, made, who made the goals? Um, William. William made both of them. William made. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. He did actually. Yeah. You lot were shit today, though, innit? Terrible. Told. Terrible. Um, yeah, I was watching the game, like, I wasn't really. Well, I was just, like, seeing it. I wasn't really watching it. Like, I didn't really have. I wasn't in the, yeah, I wasn't yeah. connected to the game. I was just like, oh, yeah, oh, that's happening now. <laughs> Expected. You know what I mean? So us having 78% of the ball in the first half, did nothing with it, had no shots on target. I was just like, yeah, more the same. Every, like, every time I come in this pod, and it's not very Where Chelsea win? Nah, nah. <laughs> it's not that often. <laughs> Chelsea don't win that It's often. the same, yeah. But it's the same, it's the same conversation. I have the same yeah. conversation, no matter well, what. Uh, dude, last time you was on here, I oh, hope yeah, you don't have him. a conversation. <laughs> <laughs> Nah, nah. I, I would, that was a different I would, conversation. Yeah. I, would, I ain't got time for all of that, mate. <laughs> <laughs> ain't gonna talk to me like that. Yeah, <laughs> please. <laughs> <laughs> no, I would actually. I'll be fair. I'll be fair. I'll be fair. I'm gonna say, I'm not gonna apologize because I think his opinions are poor. However, I would say that I shouldn't be talking to cast members like that. Oh, so that's, that's, I'll hold my hand up that's and that's say, that's bad, man. I just want to make this clear that, look, that's I went not even man. here and I managed to get an apology. That's bad, man. Certain man was sat in his chair when it happened. And really that's bad, man. <laughs> <laughs> that's bad, man. Lewis's that's bad face man. was just killing me, that's bro. Bad. Lewis that, was that, proper that, looking so like a sobriety shot. So in that regard... What's happening here? He'll see So in that regard, in that regard, I hold my hand up and say, yeah, I'm becoming of a gentleman like myself. All right, all right. However... His opinions are poor. So, we, so I'm we sorry, but what I said, I, I, said, said, I, said, I said, sorry, I said. but I'm not sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I said what I said, uh, bro. Yeah, them ones. All but right. So it's yeah. just, it was more the same. Um, I think before before the game, um, Ant sent me an interesting voice note on the group chat. <laughs> and uh, he basically said, yeah. <laughs> he said, basically, if Barkley and Kovacic turn up today, if that midfield three turn up today and start popping off, then he's on my neck. I'm like, all right, say no more. I start it. I'm like, yeah, brother. Right. <laughs> I don't, I don't worry. Don't worry, because I, I know my team in it, and I've I've seen my team, and I know I where. I know more about Chelsea than you. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! All right, I'm done now. But I I knew I knew because I I've seen the same story, and I know where our deficiencies are. So if you've got no hazard one i know there's no creation like no matter what like <laughs> so a couple of men in the group chat put the lack of Ch chelsea's lack of creativity in our midfield just basically on canter right? that's not what we that's what you like, no 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 all right not... so then let me let me go back let me go back so in the first instance when this all happened they'll say oh canter should be dropped i'm like why so they said, you've got no creation in your midfield. I'm like, yeah, that, 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 that may be true, but that's not really my concern right now. Our concern is our attack. Everything's on Hazard. And if Hazard's not buzzling, then we're not going to create, basically. Mm -hmm. And to, we've got too many players that like the ball to feet. And that's mm -hmm. also stunting the centre forward's movement and ability to get goals. Because no one's getting out of their feet quick enough to, to help him or get balls in for him to make the movement to score goals. Cool. Now... Kante, Kante's position has been come, it's been under scrutiny all season. And the maddest thing, and what I've always been saying, what I've always maintained, I've always said Kovacic should not be playing over Ruben Loftus cheek. I've maintain, maintained it from when, when we signed him. I said, I don't feel like he's a shooting for that role. Mm -hmm. I don't think that he should actually be playing in that role anyway, because he's not suited to creating anything in the final third. Mm -hmm. And we're going to lack that from if, if if Kovacic is going to play, he has to he has play to where, where yeah, Jorginho exactly. is. Yeah, exactly. Has to. Has to. There is no. That's way. all. It, all that's what he's good at. Yeah. Traveling the ball from that yeah, area. That's it. Unfortunately, Transition. though. But yeah. But the thing is, he does it dribbling. Yeah. yeah. Not passing. The ball always moves quicker when quicker. you pass. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. So Jorginho is obviously going to be a better. Yeah, of course. Of course. Now, when you play Kante, the thing is, when you, you play Kante, and my opinion. And pretty much every other Chelsea player, a Chelsea fan or watcher, will tell you 
Kante's role in the side isn't ever to facilitate play, isn't ever to create, isn't even, uh, even, isn't, he isn't even there to score goals. Yeah. However, why is Kante doing more, scoring more, assisting more than those other two? Why? Yeah, because yeah, they're, 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 so they're, they're not, not, they're not good. It. So yeah, that's what. That's so, my, fine. so when you're saying drop Kante and leave these other brothers in the team when they're not doing anything defensively, they're doing nothing defensively and nothing offensively, makes no sense to me. Right. And, when, and the, you, when you've got the defensive capacity of Kante, if things do break down, Kante is there to recover. Cool. That's why I'm keeping Kante in the team. And that's why I said if Kante doesn't play, we're going to be worse. It's going to be worse for us. Because the defensive capacity of Kovacic and Barkley isn't good enough mm. to what Kante brings. That's why I say you play Ruben off the cheek and Kante. That should be the midfield. Right, and that makes perfect sense. Now, the reasoning in, in the stance, whether Barkley and, Lof- and um, Kovacic are good enough or not, which is evidently they're not. They're like, not. We, there's no getting around it. Barkley was, I don't know what's happened. Well, I know he had bad injuries, mm. in him, but yeah. he, he's, he's lost something. Mm. Yeah. So, either way, the way I will always see it, and us, and you cannot have a player in your midfield three, mm-hmm. yeah, that players want to avoid when trying to build an attack. You say the problem is the attack, and I don't disagree with you, mm-hmm. but your midfield is just as important. Let's look at Arsenal 13 14, right. yeah, or, or even Liverpool. Liverpool got to a Champions League final because they had a nuts attack mm-hmm. with a shoddy midfield. Mm-hmm. Arsenal was in the title race in, oh, for a bit in 13-14 mm-hmm. mm-hmm. because we had a really good midfield but we had a useless attacker. Mm-hmm. So, Whoa, one hand who's your attacker? Who's your Giroud. Attacker? Okay, and who's your other two? Sanchez and Ozil. No, no, we didn't have we didn't Sanchez, have Sanchez in 13-14. Who did you have? Ozil was a creator. Who did you have? So, Ramsey was our main goal. It was, it was Ramsey, Ramsey, got, what, Ramsey Walcott and Giroud. And Ramsey got 15 that season. I think he got mm. 13 or something. Right. But again... How many did Walcott get that season? I can't remember. I swear he got, he got 20 in all comps that season. But the thing yeah. is, sure what I'm it. saying is, these, these, are, these are more creative players. In It, it was Kozula and Ozil. Uh, yeah. Wait, and that, ta- that title race, when did you fall off? Well, we always fall off. February. January. Yeah, so yeah. That, February. So again... Late February, come March. On, that's on, not January. That's, you're taking on. six nah, weeks come off. on. <laughs> Give me my six weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Them six weeks mean a lot to Arsenal fans. <laughs> nah, c- come on. Nah, come nah, on. I want my be, six be, weeks. Be serious. When it comes to title winning sides, generally speaking, it's your top part. It's your top and your, your back that's winning the title. So not your midfield? No. Not my, not, midfield. Not my, my, the, the midfield almost... Even, Almost work for itself. Even, so even, even in a team, we, even in a team that, that <coughs> that's main aim is short passing. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. But I wouldn't call that. We're not a title winning side right now. And no, I don't no, think we've got, not. I don't even feel like we've got the. Uh, do you think you're a better side than you were this time last year? No. No. That, really? That, really and truly. I, and, and Conte, Conte, no. I feel like Conte was sabotaging. It's different. So, mm. you see what I'm trying to say? It's, it's different. Is my man not doing the same no, thing? No, no. This is what I'm trying to say. This is... This is no, I this, don't understand nah, them, them, them his, his the decisions. comments. I yeah. don't, the but decision's this, baffling enough. But, but his comments... comments so, even more this is what I'm trying to say. But I, I feel like Conte, last season, was sabotaging. Because you, there was a stark difference in his approach to matches. His, the way he spoke about things after and before matches... A massive difference. He must be laughing his head yeah, off. Yeah, he's, get, he's getting a mad payoff. The, but there was a massive difference, yeah, in just the, the culture of the, the culture and the surroundings of what he was bringing to the club, yeah, right? That's true. Sorry, this is very much sorry. This is not. This is not banner. This and this yeah, is very Jack much Carini, him. Yeah, 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 this is yeah, very yeah. much him. This is very very much him. The f- he, he did he did the same thing to Mertens before Mertens bust through. Like mm. in terms of Mertens were coming, be impressive, score a goal here and there. Ousted. Even with my man, who's the guy they signed from uh, Milic? Milic, yeah. Mm-hmm. But Milic, Milic was in the side, got injured. That's why Mertens got brought through. Oh. That's how Mertens got his break. Okay. Mertens came through bus and he was undeniable because he yeah. was because Milic was out for so long. He Mertens had to play. Had to play. At, at ACL, innit? it? Yeah. And then, and Mertens then. had to play. Mertens played, mashed it up, and that's it. That's his guy now. And Milic comes back half injured and he's not really the same guy. Yeah. So you're playing Mertens all the time. So it's yeah, not, yeah, yeah. Th- this is very much His him. rotation thing Sa- is nuts. Sari's belief crazy. is he focuses on 14 players and doesn't deviate from that. That's why De Laurentiis criticised him heavily 
for his lack of rotation. And if he rotated more, he believes that his first team would have been able to go on to win the title. Yeah. You see what I'm trying Possibly. to say? Because if you're if, I, I don't if you're if you're not rotating enough and you're burning out, so him saying, "Oh, Hazard's tired. Hazard's played 50 games. Can't oh, I mean, can't play 50 games. Hazard 37, blah, blah, whatever." But you're saying, "Oh, today I rested these men because they're tired." Well, if you use your fucking brain in the first instance and rested them in certain other games yeah, yeah, before yeah. this time, they wouldn't be tired. Mm. You're over like he's yeah, overloading now, these 14 players. Yeah, but the thing is now, now he can blame the international. They, break, that's rather, what I'm trying to say, and it's cheap. Take responsibility. It's cheap. It's, it's cheap. Just, you look at, you see it. It's so transparent. You look at it because he criticizes the international break for just in terms of workload and playing. But then he also devalues these international games and saying, oh, they don't mean much in terms of levels. I'm like, what are you talking about? Do you know, like, you know what's interesting to me? Did you watch Jamie Carragher's take on? Wow, he, was, he was disgusted. Yeah, he, he, he was. He was but did I, I thought, if you, if you look, anyone that's been in football, anyone that's played football, you would understand the importance. I can't believe that Sarri doesn't understand the yeah. importance of of. Of that game, bro. He but is I so incompetent. No, he is so incompetent. I fully believe that is him. I fully. See, I don't think because of his lack of it, not experience in the game, but understanding of being in the game. Yeah, he didn't. Re- maybe he doesn't realize the implications of what he what said. What he said, bro. Yeah. Because he, said. he doesn't have that level of football education. Maybe I might be wrong mm. because it, obviously in Italy you've got to go through that bloody <coughs> what do you call it that. University, yeah, to be a you manager. need to go. You need to go to uni to get. Yeah, but surely to... you anybody would know how a player would respond to that... comments. Even if I put my thirteen-year-old on football manager, yeah, and he his eighteen-year-old made his England debut, and they said, and they asked you in the press conference on football manager, oh, your player just made his into you. You'd know not to. Yeah, who Ruff. cares? I won't watch. Like, he, he, said, he was shit anyway. Ruff, he said, he said, oh, I watched, I watched twenty minutes, minutes he and weren't he weren't that, he weren't that good anyway. He didn't start the game good. Fucking hell. They start the game good. Yeah, you know, it's almost like he, he clearly don't like the kid. It's, it's even. It's he what, it's clearly like, doesn't but like. I don't think it's. I don't think it's. I think the problem with Sari because he is so stubborn, and because like he's, he's being pushed on, yeah. on this issue, yeah, he's, yeah. he's punishing. He's, pushing back. he's punishing like Hudson Doy as a Russia. result. Yeah, he's punishing Hudson Doy as a result, and mm. I'm. I knew this was coming, bruv. I knew because the moment that you're you're telling a stubborn man, ah. Oh, you should be doing this. You should be doing this. You should be He's doing gonna, this. Yeah. It's gonna, it's, it's gonna fuel this What's agenda that? even when more, bruv. Immovable objects. Yeah, bruv. <laughs> Irresistible force. Yeah, but you're, just gonna, you're gonna fuel it even yeah. more. Yeah. And like. There is no doubt, and he says it all this. He contradicts himself so much. He's, but he's a pussy, though. Really, he's a dickhead. Because I don't understand dickhead. how my man's back in the team. The keeper. Yeah. Kepa. Kepa. Yeah, he's, yeah, a, yeah. he's a dickhead. He's a dickhead. I can't rate Sorry like, for that. There's a lot of things that, for me, Sorry has fucked up monumentous, like monumentally this season. Monumentally. Alonso starting every week. Crazy. He's, he's back in the team as well. Yeah. Crazy. He's crap. Bro. Crazy. Yeah. I think the, the Kovacic situation over Rublos' cheek, who, again, proven when he comes on, when he get, gets given games, he impacts the team positively. Yeah, he should, de- he should really definitely. Well. Crazy. He should yeah. definitely crazy. be getting a run of stars. Yeah. Cra- cra- crazy decision. Yeah, crazy. The Kepa situation. Crazy. You, you loan him out. This is the thing. You loan out a goal scorer, a, play, a, play, a player that plays in the box, plays within the 18 yard box and scores goals. You loan him out to bring in, no, to bring in a guy that offers pretty much the same thing. The same thing, I'm sorry. To a completely different standard though. That's like saying so what, a so Ford what, so Focus so what, so and a flipping Porsche so Panamera so what, so do the what, same what's thing. They don't do the same what's thing. What's Higuain offering? More than my man. No, that not, ba- no, more than not. my man. He's scored less goals than my man. In how many games? The same amount of games. Back, back to why ain't it, bro. Just he may it. not be, but you're wait. Well, there's no point wasting. Okay, there's no point. In my opinion, I hate Higuain for obvious reasons. No, no, no. There's, we know what I, he's I done can, to my yeah, guy. Of course, but, <laughs> but there's. I'm it's not sorry. even the stat. It's not even the stat. It's not even the stat because I feel like Giroud offers way more than Higuain does when he plays. Way more. Really? And, yeah, way more. I'm, and I'm, and I'm Giroud, not, Giroud has been hard. Giroud life. has been hard done by this season. Madly. Hard done by. He should be playing way more. Was he scoring when he was playing? Or Giroud would Giroud do that, barely man. played, bro. That's the maddest thing. Giroud barely played. <laughs> Giroud barely played. Yeah, that, so that's that, uh, He barely see, played. I I, I'm I'm gonna, I've suffered with Giroud for yeah, years. I, 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 I can't feel sorry for my man. I'm saying. I can't feel sorry for Giroud, The maddest thing is, you know me. I've never rated Giroud. And I didn't really want him at the club. But just going off of performances this season, you have to be objective and say, you know what? It's, he's being hard done by. 
Again, Hudson Odoi, ridiculous. Yeah, that's playing that's, Hazard that's, up front, ridiculous. Mm, playing playing Morata for half the season when you know he's not good enough, crazy. It's he's made fundamental errors all the time. Just the, the comments on psychology, the comments on the mentally fragile, the comments on not being able to train these team, train mm-hmm. these players, the comments on these players not being motivated. These are title winning players. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Title yeah. winning players, it's nuts. It is nuts. Really. It's nuts. For me, so he's to... made mad errors, yeah, mad, yeah. mad errors. Even, even, season. even, even down to not playing that Christiansen. Bruv, yeah. It's like I look at Ruga every single week, and I think, oh my god, like it's simple in every side. So, for example, Arsenal, mm. they're their centre backs, Koscielny and Socrates. Socrates, competent ones. One is the aggressor. Yeah. One is the one that you know what I mean. He he sweeps up, sweep up. he sweeps up and cleans up. Manchester United, you've got Eric Bailly, every, every, every you've got Eric Bailly and you've got Lindelof. Um, Lindelof. The only the Eric Bailly aggressor I think of that didn't have it. The two was was Rio and, and Vidic. Vidic, and that's because they were both perfectly capable. Yeah, they're both, yeah, at, they're both at both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it doesn't really matter. Yeah. So so you I always generally know. speaking, you always have the aggressor and the one that is a competent, calm sweeps up. Mm. Every single side in the league, every, well, pretty much every single side in the league has it. Every, but how are you playing? That, that David Luiz is not the cool, calm, collected one that's sweet. Nor is Rudiger. Rudiger is way more rash. Rudiger is rash, bruv. You could even look at look at what's it called? Carlos I think they both as rash as each other. But this is it's what I'm just, trying to say. You Rudiger's can't. Rudiger's faster, so he can get there. Yeah, so you can't. <laughs> so you can't. <laughs> get to the rushes, that's that's what I'm trying to say. So you can't have, <laughs> just for the sake of balance, your defensive balance, you cannot have two aggressors because you're going to consistently make <coughs> mistakes because one of no, no neither are going to be sweeping up after each other for me it's, it's good to hear it's this because as an Arsenal fan I can't lie like when you got Sarri and we got Emery I was jealous like but but seeing like all of this sort of unfold it's mental I don't know maybe it might have transpired differently at Arsenal but I think a lot of the fundamentals are still there isn't it the only, the only difference would at Arsenal is that we don't have youth prospects yeah, yeah, enough quality for it to for actually it to be, be as, as, as obvious. Yeah, yeah. and I don't like feel if like... if he's not playing it won't be. Yeah, no yeah you know what's going to be like, oh, that's yeah. just ridiculous. Because yeah. yeah. I look at your yeah. bench, I don't think you've got enough quality there yeah. to be saying, oh, you should be playing, yeah, yeah. you should be playing, that should be playing. You don't have that. Yeah. We definitely do. Mm. Like, our deficiencies, you can see Ruben improves you. Mm. Chris Jensen improves you. Mm. Um, Emerson improves you. Yeah, yeah. Um, Hudson Alonso improves you. That's already, that's what, 50% of the team. Mm. You're already going to go up a level. Two up, well, well, about 40% of the team. 40% of the team. You're already, so from that 40%, you're going to increase a level or two. And that level or two is enough for you to beat certain opposition. So today, we should not be struggling against Cardiff. I'm so you sorry. don't think Marcus Alonso should be on the team? No way in hell. So let's move on from Marcus Alonso. Let's word association. Okay. <laughs> Driving the wheel. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, because that you that you should be in jail, man. Just just that before we move on, yeah. Jail, this is what uh, uh, Neil Warnock said. Yeah, he said, "I've had one kick in the teeth after another this season, and so are the players." Uh, so he's basically shut saying, up, man. He said, "My man, no, what his player? Like, no, my no, sympathy for Cardiff squad on that topic." He said he's gonna play the twenty threes against City. <laughs> what is he? He's gonna play the under twenty threes against I mean, City. Why uh, did he say yeah. that? I I dare him and, and then rest, I, I dare rest him them and, and, and when them. they hold ten, yeah, Where? watch watch them all them kids flipping quit football. Yeah, <laughs> but I, I said karma anyway. Like I'm happy they lost, but, but yeah, I don't. Yeah, I, I, no, I didn't want no to. I, 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 I genuinely wanted us to lose today so sorry could go. I, I, it's gotten to that point mm. because. I looked at um, Hudson Door on the bench today. We didn't come on. Yeah, we need. He, he, he didn't get on. He, he Bruv, didn't come no. on. Oh, Matic, but during warm up. Yeah, that's Bruv, Bruv, yeah. Let's, let's 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 move on. Yeah, Chelsea, like we, we, two weeks in a row. You can see it. Much, you can see in his face, time. bro. So yeah, Oli's at the wall. Will full time. When I spit bars in a rave, man, I go hard like Santana.